welcome viewers and subscribers. I'm happy to see you again on a new video. Uh, last few videos we have been discussing more about uh, something related to the subject. So today let's talk something about uh, Sanguine Logistics Private Limited. My name is Lala Diyasitanabi, Director of Sanguine Logistics Private Limited. We are a customs broker company. What is a customs broker? Customs broker is a broker who is appointed from the customs under Customs Regulation Act 2018. Basically, we are supposed to write examinations conducted by the customs and we appear for oral examinations. Then customs appoints us as a customs broker agent. We are thorough with the subject of Customs Act 1962, then Customs Tariff Act, then related to the DGFT, Directorate of Foreign Trade, and other allied departments. So anything related to any export or import from India, as a customs broker, we are supposed to be very clear with the acts and the policies. If you look at in a court, how an advocate takes the laws and argues for the client as well as on the part of the judgment. The same way, as a customs broker, we are supposed to know the customs acts and regulations. Whatever updates, whichever is being given, by time to time any changes are being given, we are supposed to study the act and explain the same to the client. If the client is unable to understand, it is the responsibility of the customs broker to make them understand at the same time. If a customs officer has a doubt or a clarification, as a customs broker, we are supposed to get the details from the client and update the customs. Today, in the changing scenario of digitalization, things are changing. And the government is looking forward for the exporters or importers to understand everything on their own. What is faceless assessment? Today, the technology is changed. The world is moving towards digitalization, and even the government departments started making things very easy through digitalization. So earlier, the customs activities where we have to file the bill of entry to people, we have to take the documents physically to the customs office meet the customs officer, explain about the product, the details about the product, the interest codes, the pricing, the volume and all the documents related to the shipment. But today, everything is digitalized with upload of documents online. We have to file the bill of entry or the shipping bill online and even the supporting documents has to be uploaded online. Like a, a designated officer who was expert in that particular HS code, he reviews the document and also if he has any clarification, he will raise the queries online and it is the responsibility of the customs broker or the exporter or importer to answer the query. Now, the understanding has to be very clear. Say, the customs officer raises a query of the justification of the HS code or the value or the weight of the product has to be given. The importer or exporter or the customs broker has to understand what exactly is being asked and the ownership lies on the client to satisfy the customs query. As a company, we believe in the transformation of the digitalization. We are the first company to bring up mobile application which will track the complete time to time basis with a clear visibility of the customs clearance activities followed by the documents which are required. The client can easily access and even we are going forward with the delivery aspect also where it can be tracked through online. So thanks for watching this video. We would like to get some comments and any clarifications to be done, we can 
Thank you and support you. Thank you so much.